Remember, hope is the beacon that lights our way through the darkest nights. It's the cord that binds the symphony of our dreams, and it's the fuel that drives our journey towards success. Imagine for a moment that you're in a world of darkness, a world where the only light you see is a tiny spark, a small flicker. That spark is hope. It's small, it's fragile, but it's there. It's burning, and it's all you have. In the heart of this darkness, there lived a man named Samuel. Samuel was not always in the dark. There was a time when his world was full of color, full of life. He was a successful entrepreneur, running a thriving business. But as fate would have it, a series of unfortunate events led to the collapse of his business. Samuel found himself in the dark, lost and alone. But remember that tiny spark? Samuel had that too. He had hope. He had a dream, a vision of a better future. He knew that the darkness was not his destiny, that he was meant for something more. He held on to that spark, he nurtured it, he let it grow. And so, Samuel started again. He built a new business from the ground up. It was not easy. There were times when the darkness threatened to consume him, times when his hope seemed like it would extinguish. But Samuel did not give up. He kept going, kept pushing, kept hoping, Years passed and Samuel's hope did not waver, and as his hope grew, so did his success. His business thrived and he found himself in a world full of color once again. Samuel had found his way out of the darkness, guided by the light of his hope. So, what can we learn from Samuel's story? First, hope is a powerful force. It can guide us through the darkest times and lead us towards success. Second, it's not about how many times you fall, but about how many times you get back up. Failure is not the end. It's just a stepping stone towards success. And finally, we learn that success is not just about making it to the top. It's about the journey, the struggle, the hope. It's about believing in yourself and in your dreams, even when the world tells you otherwise. In conclusion, remember this. Hope is not just a feeling, it's a choice. It's a decision to believe in the possibility of a better tomorrow. It's the decision to keep going, to keep fighting, to keep dreaming. And it's this decision, this choice, that can lead to incredible success. So hold on to your hope. Nurture it. Let it grow. Let it guide you through your journey towards success. Because as Samuel showed us, even in the darkest times, hope can be the best medicine for success.